Well, hello there, and thanks for coming by and having tea with Linda. In case you didn't know, I'm Linda. Hi! Today, my friends, we will be having a Marsala chai from Tea Heaven. I know absolutely nothing about this tea maker, nothing about this tea. Um, we actually found it on a trip to the Indian grocer. So I'm really excited um, to see what it's all about. Um, you know, if you want a good Marsala chai, you'd think going to the Indian grocer would give that to you. Um, so. Let's see. I probably should have asked them, you know, what they like to drink. They probably would have told me coffee. <laughs> Wouldn't that have been my luck? <laughs> okay, this is the Tea Heaven Marsala Chai blended with seven spices, premium Indian tea. The Tea Heaven is a is a journey to take you back to the tea gardens where women stroll eight to 10 hours every day to pick the finest tea leaves for your perfect cup of tea. These leaves are directly procured by our 38 year old experienced tea expert and stored in smart cold stores. This tea arrives to you in a three layered revolutionized food graded tins to ensure the farm experience in your cup. Seeping instructions. All right. Uh, heat water, put two grams of tea and sweetener as per your taste in the water. Boil everything together. Strain the Okay. So we're not doing it the proper way. Uh, we're going to do it the Linda's not cooking on the cooktop today way. Um, a dedicated tea worker, Rupinder, packed this product. Ooh, I could be wrong, but I'm sure I spelled her name wrong. But they put her little picture here on the tin. That's kind of cool. Um, let's see. Our ingredients are cloves, cinnamon, cardamom, star anise, white pepper, star anise, ginger, black pepper, and CTCT. That's interesting. Tea is the last thing listed. So does that mean that there's the spices and all is more than the tea? Hmm. This was processed and packed by Tea Haven Private Label in Dury BP RP, I don't know, India. Um, hmm. Hmm, said so the babysitter. Let's see if I can open it without spilling it everywhere. Oh, and you know what, friends? They just got serious points for me double sealed with this beautiful airtight lid on it. Oh my gosh, I love this already. Oh, that smells so good. Oh my God, it smells so good. <laughs> I mean, look at this. Oh my gosh. You can see all the cardamom, the cloves. I'm not seeing any star in these. Um, you got your cinnamon. Oh my God, it's got so many cloves in it. And it does have the typical tea grounds that you that you find in um, Assam teas. I'm trying to find a spoon. Yay. All right, so we have our wonderful tea maker um, making it, again, incorrectly as we are not making it on the cooktop. Um, we're making it the, I don't have a cooktop in my studio. I do have one here. I mean, I am in the kitchen, but I'm just, I'm not set up for that today. All right. So we're putting in a teaspoon and a smidge with our water. Hey Siri, set a timer for three minutes. We'll put our timer here as well. All right, 
the green one, the middle one, is our three minute timer. And let's wait for it to brew. Hey Siri, stop timer. All right, so we have a little bit of time left in our three minutes. That's just because I started to late. So we're gonna go ahead and move this out of the way and put you back. So we're gonna give this a little bit of a stir. All right, so we've given it a little bit of a stir and now we're going to dispense our fluid. I love how this fits perfectly on this teacup. The other ones, they don't always. Sometimes it's a crapshoot. That is a lovely color, is it not? Okay, so it is cloudy and that's okay. With all those spices, you could only expect that it would be that. Uh, you can see things pass beneath it, so it is translucent. Uh, I cannot tell if there's particulate, but I'm sure that there probably will be. Uh, this does have a beautiful color to it. Uh, I would I would call this the Yum Yum color, uh, except it's not see-through. So yum, yum, no, I'm joking, yum, 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 yum. Um, the smell in the cup is, it's absolutely amazing. I mean, the smells, freaking amazing. Um, let's try it. It absolutely needs sugar. <laughs> um, it's, it's bitter, uh, at the beginning. Um, the, the tea is very bitter. So I'm getting this bitter astringent taste followed by all these wonderful spices. So what I'm going to say is that doing it this way is not the best way. Um, cooking this on the stove with the milk and sugar and doing it the proper way, this would be freaking amazing. Um, because it's, it's made to be able to cook that way. Um, it's, it's made to be able to hand up, handle being able to be cooked like that. Uh, just add boiling water and let it sit around for three minutes. It's not, it's not manufactured in the way, it's not blended in the way to have that. There are other more solid ties that we've had that are blended up that way. Uh, that tastes phenomenal. This one though, it really needs to be done properly on the cooktop. Um, so proper on the cooktop, I, this would be amazing. It might even give the Vaudamte a run for its money. Um, wow. All right, well, thanks so much for coming by and having a couple with me today. I really do appreciate it. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day and I look forward to seeing you the next time. Bye.